Security tightened how to prepare for the royal wedding? The countdown from Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's royal wedding has begun with just one month before the couple say I do, as the biggest wedding of the year. Police today launched a pre-royal wedding security operation to scour the streets of Windsor for any potential bomb threats. Specialist explosive detection dogs from Thames Valley Police searched letterboxes, drains and phone booths for any signs of potential explosive devices ahead of Meghan and Harry wedding next month. More than 100,000 visitors are expected to pack the streets outside of Windsor Castle as fans hope to catch a glimpse of the newlyweds as they embark on a carriage procession through the town following the ceremony in St. George's Chapel. Earlier Express.co.uk reported that Windsor will be turned into a fortress with anti-vehicle barriers installed to protect pedestrians in the event of a terror attack by cars or heavy-duty vehicles. An additional CCTV cameras are being installed as well as extra technology to recognize number plates. A Thames Valley Police statement said, the public should be reassured, not alarmed. Today police teams checked through drains for potentially dangerous devices and carried out searches in Home Park in the shadow of Windsor Castle. PC Aronson Claire Day who has worked on the force for five years added, Searching drains may seem strange but you can never be too careful. Meanwhile, Police Search Coordinator Sergeant Andy Turner added, Having been on the police force for 27 years, this is a large operation for any police force and one of the biggest I have worked on. We of course want it to all go smoothly and the focus be on the two people in love getting married. Nearly all officers from the force will be working on the day with all leave requests being denied for the weekend and a screening and search regime will be introduced as the town is cordoned off before the big day. Royal fans, who have been known to camp out for days before major events, have also been told they cannot bring tents to Windsor. The operation, believed to be the largest in the force's history, will also see a step up in police dog patrols that are already regularly seen in Windsor. Sergeant Turner added, This is business as usual for us. Windsor Castle is an iconic location and therefore we often have patrols in the area. There is a large uniform presence but we ask that if people do see something that doesn't look right to let us know. Shops and buildings will be searched in the days leading up to the wedding and plans are in place to stop trains from calling at Windsor Station town becomes too crowded and a public safety risk. And on the day of the wedding people will have to go through full body scanners as Windsor will be part of cordoned off as part of the royal wedding's security measures. Police have not announced the exact date of when the secure zone would be implemented for security reasons. A Thames Valley Police statement said, Visitors to the town can expect to see our officers, both armed and unarmed, our search dogs and our mounted section out and about. There are also many security measures that you can see.